Hi, everybody. Welcome to EA Sports. Well, the home team will try to finish up with some pride and end things on a positive after what has been a disappointing homestand. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. Dumps it in. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Takes the feed. Puck grabbed by Riley. Quick pass across to Johns. Here we go. Puck's in deep. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Grabbed along the boards by Martin. Here he is wow. on the backhand. And it's in the back of the net. Wow, this was quick. Hard to believe the game can change so quickly. An early score. And it is something that nobody quite expected. Toronto's got that lead. They were talking about wanting to quiet that home crowd here. Well, they certainly did. Out of the gate quickly. A couple of shifts. Now they're up 1-0. Puck scooped up by Savard. Slick feed. Moves it to Suzuki. And he takes the feed. Takes a shot. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow. Moves with the puck at the corner. Jocelyn for the puck, but still moves away. Dumps the puck in. Couldn't complete the play. Let's it fly. And that carries off a stick. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Marner's got the puck now. He had the go-ahead goal earlier. Here's a short pass to Matheson. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Poked away in the neutral zone by Gallagher. And now he angles it across to Latang. Too many bodies in the way. And he takes the pass. The Leafs have it against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Quick pass to Gallagher. And makes the save. We see goaltenders in this butterfly practicing it every day. Positioning, keeping their arms tight, making sure that they stay in the center of the puck. A reminder, the team store always accessible to you online, 24-7, 365 online. But don't forget, you can also visit their uh, location in person at the arena. Open seven days a week. Check it out. Some very cool stuff to get your hands on these days. In the offensive zone with the puck. You know, he's thinking about his next milestone that's sitting one goal away. Montembeau's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Toronto's up one zip. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Love save made by Montembeau. Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that's blocked from someone in front. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Hartman. That goes off the blocker. What a save by Montembeau. The Canadians grab possession to the puck. Montreal's looking to break out. The Canadians play it along the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. Quick feed to Anderson. Oh, just puts it wide of the net. Uh, trying to be a little fine with it. This is a good goaltender. You know, you have to make a really great shot to beat him but he just fires it wide. A chance in front! And that's doubled up and will get a whistle for a face-off. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. The Leafs lead it 1-0. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Sends the pass over. And a great save! 
wrestles stick handily in his own zone. Moves it to Hall. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Stopped by the goaltender. What a great glove save by the goaltender here. He's got to get out, stay up long enough to keep the glove high, and make a remarkable glove save. Evans wins the draw inside his defensive zone. Slides the puck across to Shekai. And he takes the feed. Sends it in deep. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Tries to get it to Klingberg. Battling for it along the boards. Can't get a hold of that pass. And he takes the dish. And now he moves it to Domi. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Montreal's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. And a good save on the play as action continues. John moves so well with the puck. It's his real zone ability that makes him fly up the ice. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Riley's got it in the defensive end. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Cuts to the front. Gains the zone along the right wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. Takes the puck behind the net. Takes the feed. From one end of the blue line to the other. Gains control of the puck here at the line. Matheson's taking it from his own end. And now he tries to get it across to Caulfield. Here they come on the attack. Quick pass to Suzuki. The Leafs are in transition. Here's a short pass to Johns. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Montembeau's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Getting into the later stages of this period. one nothing to score. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come on the attack as they slide the puck inside the offensive zone. And that goes off a player. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Crisps on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. What's the puck on net? And that shot gets caught in traffic. They fight for it along the boards. Tries to the crease. Stopped by the goaltender. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. How did he stop that one? And that's blocked. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Whatever happens on this penalty kill will have an impact going into the next period. It's an important time in the game. Man advantage unit is set. Montreal's won the face-off deep in their own end. The Leafs have it behind the cage. Passes it over to Matthews. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Passes it in front. And stopped. Picked up along the wall by Johns. Takes the feed at the point. Takes the shot. Off the club and makes the save. Montembeau is going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly 
Matthews is ready for the faceoff as we are about to resume this power play. The Canadians win it in the defensive zone. Big stop just as time expires in the period. That'll do it for the opening frame. We've got lots more still in store, so don't even think about going anywhere for rail fight. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. Montreal's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Moves it quickly over to Voracek. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. Poked away at center by Edmondson. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Off the left wing and into center. Moves it to the middle. Dishes it off again here. The Canadians gain possession of the defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick feed to Matthews. Into the offensive end now. Moves it to Voracek. And now he moves it quickly to Carlson. The center and feed. And he denies that. Great opportunity there. Here's a chance. Oh, turns it aside once again. They are really pouring on the pressure here. Moves it over to Matthews. Comes up with a stop. Gallagher's time is almost done. Quick pass to Matthews. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Montreal's got the puck now. The Leafs fail to capitalize on the power play. I liked everything about that power play, James, except the fact that they couldn't put it in the net. Everything about it looked really good. Sends it into the offensive zone. Taves plays it now. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Receives the pass. Moves it around along the half wall. Here's a short pass to Marner. Sends a pass over. Blocked in traffic. But picked up by Savard. Gaining momentum up along the side. Toronto's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Kessel. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. The Canadians scoop it up along the boards. Savard's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Caulfield. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Wrists one. Oh, what a save in front. Good save. Positional save through traffic. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Toronto's ahead, 1-0. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Voracek. Montreal's grabbed a hold of the puck. And now he angles it across to Gallagher. The Canadians carry it along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Cooley. Club save. They opt to play the puck instead here. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Quick feed to Bergeron. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. What a stop right there. Moves it to Drouin. Fires it on now. Wow. Scores! And just like that, we are tied. Now you got to keep grinding back in the game. You fall behind, you can't give up. You've got to find a way to make an opportunity without taking too many chances. It's a fine line, James, but they've done it perfectly. Has dropped and we are back underway. The Leafs have it against the wall. Picks up the puck in his own end. And that pass is redirected. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. 
And the puck's not loose. Quick pass to Gouli. Montreal's through center and now in the offensive end. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Gets the puck in deep. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Montreal's got the puck against the half wall. It just gets a piece of that one to keep it out. Once he drops into that butterfly, he's pretty confident he's got most of the net covered. He slides across to make the save. And now he moves it to Riley. Takes that pass back at the point. Through pass ahead. And he slides it quickly to Carlson. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Pass to Matheson. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Here's a short pass to Anderson. Turns it away. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Oh, and another big stop. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Well past the midway mark of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Suzuki's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. And that was off a player in front. Official blows the play dead as the puck goes out of bounds. Puck possession so critical in today's game and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Toronto's got possession here in their own end. Passes the puck over to Klingberg. The Leafs will play it in their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Edmondson. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Moves it quickly over to Suzuki. Big save by the goaltender once again. The Leafs gain possession. Martin goes on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. The Leafs win the faceoff. A chance at court! Oh, he comes up with a stop. Moves the puck. Evans takes it into the offensive end. Fires it! Oh, and he just got enough of that one to keep it out. Crisp's been terrific tonight. I mean, I don't know what more they could ask for the win goal. He has been excellent under deluge at times, but his team's in the game because he's been so good. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Penalty coming up here. Edmondson's going to get two for charging. go up and down that's just the way they are but when you haven't been successful you've got to reload refocus and get to work on that next one the canadians will play it from the defensive zone toronto's got a hold of it along the wall from the open ice they gain the line puck battle along the boards and some good footwork to kick it away Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Nice job to escape the zone. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Takes it across the blue line. Slides the puck over. They clear the zone. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Taken by Johns. Turns it aside with a blocker by Montembeau. Nice pass. Quick feed to Voracek. The Leafs move it in. Voracek's got it along the wing. Toronto's got it now. 
That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Seagrass will look to win possession here on the face-off and try to continue this power play on the right note. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Right on the doorstep. Matheson's caught with the stick and the officials are signaling for a hooking penalty. A nice little break for the defenseman here. One less forward to deal with as we have some four-on-four -four hockey on tap. Once you get the puck on four-on-four, on four, just don't give it up. You've got space. Use it. Handles it along the blue line. Handles the puck. Here he is from the slot. Big save. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Just here in the late stages of this frame, it's all tied up. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Shot with the stop. Montreal's got some room to do something here on this power play as their penalty expired. Gains the zone from the right. Centering feed! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there! Bergeron's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Toronto's won the draw. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Poked away yet centered by Fowler. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. The Canadians scoop it up along the boards. Passes over to Caulfield. Handles the pass. And the puck departs the zone. Puts the puck in play cross quarter. Scooped up along the wall by Caulfield. Looks to set up at the point now. Makes his presence known on the ice. Toronto's penalty killers get a hold of it. The Canadians have it behind the net. Takes the pass. Marner's ready to go. And that's off target as it hits a body. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed, and we are still tied. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK doesn't... Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Shot! Let's get the call. Now you can see how uneasy everybody is on the bench. I looked over there, and everyone knows it's late in the period. You need this kill. penalty kill is ranked toward the bottom of the league, but tonight they've already successfully shut down this power play here. Let's see what they can do with this next opportunity and see if they're able to shut them down again. Moves it to Drouet. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Johnson Company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Montreal got it in the offensive zone. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Monahan's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Montreal got it along the wall. Jabs the puck away. The Leafs have it against the wall. Montreal's looking to break out of their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Gets a glove on it to make the save. 
Crisps on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. John slides into the face-off dot, and they'll continue to try to kill off this penalty. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. He was totally locked in on that play. That's a great A chance, and the goaltender beats the shooter with the glove. Dead center, turned away. All right, that brings period number two to an end. Uh, the ice resurfacers coming out onto the ice. They'll give it a little cleaning, and I can see Ray Ferraro down there between the benches tap dancing. I can only imagine where he needs to go. Third period, just around the corner. During the game, with all times in our seating area, They're ready to drop the puck on period number three. He's Ray Perot. I'm James Sabalski. Let's do this. The Leafs win the draw and get their penalty killing unit off to a good start. Along the wing up the neutral zone. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nice feed. And he had an answer with that save. Bergeron's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Offense is on faceoff and he wins the draw. Oh, and they can't keep the puck in the zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. And the pass is picked off. Takes a shot. And that's off the club and will play on. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Canadians gain control of the puck against the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Cuts to the paint. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Dead center, excellent save. Montreal's got it behind the net. Takes the feed. Montreal's got the puck against the boards. Crisp's gonna cover it up. He's been busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Toronto's got it in the defensive zone. And he jumps out of the sin bin here, back to even strength. Solid effort by the penalty killing unit here. Well, the penalty killers can go back to the bench knowing they did their job. Score remains the same as it was when that penalty was taken. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Slick feed. Poked away in the neutral zone by Bergeron. Montreal's got a hold of the puck now. Through center along the wing. Quick pass to Devorah. Stopped by the goaltender. Slides across in the butterfly to make the save, but you still have to be agile even though you're covering the bottom of the net. Toronto's on the attack. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. And now he tries to get it across to Drouin. Scrum ensues along the boards. Across the point. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Drouin. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Scores! And the deadlock is broken! Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys work hard for it. They press the play, and now they've got the lead. Toronto's got the one goal lead here in this third period. What's the strategy now in your mind, Coach? I don't think you change at all. I, I also don't know in today's game how you defend or be conservative. You're just inviting trouble to do that. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Let's see what the officials are calling. You work so hard to get back in the game. Now you have a stall. A penalty will really hamper your momentum. Another scoring opportunity looms here. 
really doesn't matter if the power play scored before or not in this game, which it hasn't. You've got to focus in on the one that you've got right now. It's time to tee off on this one. Hammers one, and that doesn't reach the net. Here's a short pass to Horacek. The Canadians gain possession of the defensive zone. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Toronto's got the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Puck grab by Johns. Dismissed that chance. Bang bang play right in the low slot. The goalie's on top of him. He makes a really astute save here by reading the play well and turning it aside. A chance to get it out of the defensive zone. Off his own man and it stays in. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Johns doesn't go into a game now thinking he's not going to get on the board. He's on a point streak. He thinks he's scoring every night. Evans wins the draw inside his defensive zone. And the puck clears the zone. The Leafs have it now. Looks to make a play over to Kessel. Zegers takes it into the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Carlson. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. And he comes up with it. Quick feed to Marner. And he takes the feed. Sends it across. Whoa. Oh, right with the man advantage. And they make it click. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Toronto's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Matthews wins it inside the neutral zone. Sent into the offensive zone. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. From the right side and up the middle. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Grabbed along the board by Caulfield. Denied by the goaltender. Slides it up to Matthews. Montreal's got possession at center. Poked away by Matthews. The Leafs take it across the blue line. Maintains possession. Denies them in close. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Denies him again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Looks like lineups are set and they're ready to get things back underway. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And he moves it up to Dvorak. Unable to reach that one. Slides it to Riley. The Leafs play it along the boards. Poked away by Gallagher. Now he takes it over the line. Puck jumped in, allowing for the blue line to get some fresh legs out there. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Poked away at center by Domi. Shot! Gives them nothing in front. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck, so the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Past the midway mark in this period. Crowd's been into this one right from the get-go. It's 3-1. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Moves it to Hall. And he takes the pass. Oh, how did that stay out? What a toe stop on the play. That happened so quickly, that low slot shot. The goaltender's in position and he makes the save. Hits the feet in front. And that's intercepted. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Canadians have it now. Carries it across the line. Shot! And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. Cutting to the front of the net. And he comes up with it. And now it's grabbed by Gallagher. Save made by the goalie. No time to take a breath. He made that first stop, and then the puck turns around on him again. The Canadians gain control of the puck. 
looking for space inside the D zone. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Sends the pass over. Works it across to Latang. The Leafs slide it through center. Hartman's gonna play it against the half wall. Here he is, shot right in front. Montembeau's gonna cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. Who had the edge? Carlin standing by with the answer. Johns hasn't disappointed when it comes to the offense. He's helped contribute and I'm giving him my vote for this matchup, guys. Handles the puck at the point. Goes right to the crease. That's gloved by Montembeau. We often talk about a goalie's reflexes. You've got to have quick hands. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Caulfield. Taken along the wall by Taves. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Quick pass to Taves. Poked away in the neutral zone by Caulfield. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Oh, a little cat burger. Scores! Well, how does this change the perception of this game now? Well, all of a sudden, the other team's back on their heels. They're only one goal behind now. They keep working. Maybe you get another. Montreal's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Evans wins the draw. They'll go to work offensively here. Great defensive effort with the stick. Chase right in front. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Turns another aside. 17 minutes, 32 seconds. Getting into the later stages of this period. The Canadians have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Play rolls on. Into the offensive zone. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Riley. Denied that one. Approaching the final minute of regulation. Moves inside! Again the denial by the goaltender. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. And sneaks in there on the tie-up and comes up with the puck. Takes a shot. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Oh, the bench all stood up. Now they sit down. That was a chance to spread this game out. Oh, that could have been the insurance marker they needed. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Riley. The Canadians really need a goal here. They pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. He scores! Uh, 25 goals is a great number to achieve. That means you've had a solid year. The Leafs add the insurance marker, which pretty much seals the deal on this one tonight, Ray. Well, their opponents pull the goalie. They're trying to pressure to get the tying goal, but it backfires, and the empty netter puts it away. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Here's a chance! Denies him! Montembeau's outstanding play continues. That's a great save. Gains the zone from the right side. Montembeau's at the bench, allowing for the extra attacker to jump on. And it is all over with this one. Montreal's performance seemed to be good enough to win, but they just can't find a break. No, what they're finding is the way to lose. Again, they played well. It's a close loss but they found the way to make the big mistake at the worst time. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Cebalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.